This book is called Radical Honesty, and I wrote it after about 25 years of private practice in Washington, D.C., which is the best place in the world to study lying. And I learned from my clients and from my own personal life that honesty really is the best policy, given that what keeps you trapped in the jail of your mind is lying. And we all lie like hell all the time because we've been taught a mistaken identity. Most of my therapy practice was getting people over their schooling and parenting. And what they learned in school and from their parents was that who they were were their reputations, the grades they made, how much money they earned, what kind of job they got, what other people thought of. And I teach them to tell the truth so that they can discover that they are in fact people who notice, who live in the present moment, and that the present moment noticing being is my primary identity, your primary identity, everyone else's primary identity. And if you move your reputation and your case history to the background and that to the foreground, there's no longer any need to lie to maintain your identity. So if you give up lying to maintaining your identity, to maintain your identity, you then discover your true identity. And here is what allows you to be powerful and be intimate in relationships and to be capable of creating using your mind rather than the victim of your own mind. That was the first book, and that became a nationwide bestseller. It's now been published in 14 languages. The new revised edition just came out two years ago. It's been reprinted two times, and it's there's been an additional surge of international language rights sales. So this is a book worth reading because it's a participant in the ongoing change in humanity toward the possibility of our survival rather than our extinction.